Hi, my name is Dr. Riley Parker. I'm a dentist with Prairie Rose Family Dentist. And on this episode of our Myth Series, I'm going to discuss the dental myth. Radiation from dental x-rays is dangerous. Are dental radiographs or x-rays safe? Radiographs have been an essential part of dentistry for over 120 years. Like any health procedure, the how and the why of x-rays has changed greatly in those 120 years. But in order to understand how these changes affect what we experience in the dental office, we need to understand what is going on when we take an x-ray. X-rays work in a similar way to the way we see things with light. X-rays, like all forms of energy, are waves that can be reflected by or go through various materials, like how light goes through clear glass but reflects on other surfaces, like a wall. We use these properties to see through things that light cannot, such as soft tissue and bone, and especially teeth. By using small doses of x-rays, we can create images that show varying densities in these different materials and it allows a trained professional to identify many types of conditions, everything from cavities, gum disease, to injuries, breaks, even more serious illnesses. By taking regular x-rays, we're also able to have images to compare to over time. However, are they safe? Well, yes, when done correctly. All dental radiographs use some type of x-ray imaging. These x-rays can be dangerous at higher doses because all that energy moving through cells can bump into critical structures, this can cause damage, and is usually referred to as radiation damage. It should be said that not just x-rays do this, all forms of radiation moving through your body can cause small amounts of damage, in some instances from things we would not expect. The radiation from the sun is the leading cause. But even some of the foods we eat produce small amounts of radiation. Foods high in potassium, like bananas and nuts, produce radiation. Or even more dangerous sources, like radon gas. We refer to all these other sources as background radiation, and we know that our bodies can tolerate certain levels. Using that data, we know that dental x-rays radiation dose vary from a single film comparable to one day of background radiation to larger 3D imaging, which can be like several days of background radiation. To compare, an x-ray scanner at the airport is 80 times the dose of a single dental x-ray, x-ray or like a single day of background radiation. A chest x-ray can be up to a thousand times that. Also take into account that traditional de dental x-rays used film which required higher doses than the digital x-rays. The digital sensors which we use here for all radiographic evaluations at Prairie Rose allow for a higher quality x-ray at significantly lower doses. The good thing about dental x-rays is that just by being below levels that are considered dangerous because of the way radiation works, they're completely safe. In fact, because our bodies are constantly repairing the damage from background radiation, the usage of dental x-rays creates no discernible difference in a person's health outcomes. So, Regular x-rays are not just safe to use, but because their usage allows us to diagnose other diseases, their use improves a person's health outcomes. This means the myth radiation from dental x-rays is dangerous has been busted. Thanks so much for watching our video. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more content like this, make sure to like and subscribe to our channel.